Hey, Earth placements, sin of inspiration in the reverse, signifying that all of those burdens is done. Like the endings are definitely here. If you don't want too much, now you're seeking a new path. You're no longer stressing over, you know, the bullshit. You realize that whatever was going on, it wasn't emotionally fulfilling you. Your wishes were not coming true. Your manifestations were not showing up. You were not, uh, you know, moving into karma waters. You were not receiving any kind of assistance from spirit. Um, and so now you know what you have to do. You have to manifest. You have to really put that work in. Like I always tell you guys, when it comes to your actual coin, y'all on it. But that internal work, y'all be so stubborn. You know what I'm saying? And you can work as hard as you want to on the outside. But if you don't have the discernment, the wherewithal, and the internal peace for it, you ain't going to be happy. So now you are manifesting and really planting and sowing those seeds to get out of this ten of voices energy, to get out of this heartbreak energy. So ten ten, both in the reverse, you know, you are ending a bad cycle of bullshit and starting something new. The devil in the upright, obsessive, toxic energy. Um and I feel like that's what you were admitting or people around you were admitting that you probably just got sucked into it because you have the three of materials here. So you were admitting some kind of toxic energy to mentally, emotionally, financially manipulate someone because you have also the queen of voices here in the reverse. This bitchy energy, someone who is not intuitive, not utilizing their discernment, very manipulative with their words and with their actions. So you were doing whatever you needed to do in order to get by, in order to maintain your stability, connecting with people with the sole purpose of, I'm just trying to make money, fuck your friendship. But in their face, you were just like, hey, friend or maybe they were doing that to you you saw that no new blessings were coming in you like i said no new clarity no new ideas none of that shit because like i said you were focused on your money and not your internal work but you understand that you have to take a leap of faith now away from that energy get away from it even if that's all that you know how to be manipulative negative whatever try something new i promise you your life will prosper um, so yeah, taking that leap of faith, new beginnings definitely coming for the horizon, you know, on the horizon for you. Like I said, you have some endings happening. And so your new beginnings is you being fated to win, you being fated to be successful. Spirit is not giving up on you. No matter how much you have given up on yourself, spirit is not giving up on you. And now you can mentally see, you can speak your truth clearly here. Eight of voices in the reverse. You are not bound to the bullshit. The tower came and shook up some, you know, old foundation. So you can understand like, hey, that manipulative energy, that negative energy, it needs to fucking go because you cannot be great holding that in or being surrounded by that and because that tower came in and shook up your foundation and made you see clearly so you could take this leap of faith into the you know the unknown you have the muse of emotions and the sun card you are at bliss you are at peace you are ultimately happy you are emotionally fulfilled now because you allow spirit to come in and show you that you are fated to win you are fated to succeed get away from this negative energy leave the past alone because it did not emotionally fulfill you and you had to be manipulative to get what you want that's not your life earth placements you got this